So like I said, we're going to be in jumping into Illustrator. And we want to take a look at a particular panel, which is the Appearance panel. If you don't have that, you can go to Window, Appearance. And that's also a Shift F6 if you want to use the key command. I have it down here. So I'm just going to pull this guy out because this is basically what we're going to be using today. Um, I wanted to show some different things with type. So first of all, I'm just going to go ahead and type something out. And let's make it something nice and bold so we can see it. Real black should work. And then we'll boost it up here. Let's get it real big. All right, so we're going to be messing with this type here. And you're going to notice that when we do certain things in here, you're going to see in the appearance panel what's going on with this thing. It's kind of like your little guide to an object. So once I have this object selected, it's going to tell me pretty much everything about this. So I generally I'm going to do things like, you know, put a fill on this, fill it with a color, whichever color I want, maybe put a stroke on it as well, and then just go from there. Now certain things that you might be able to do in, in one area, you can't do in another area. One of those things is, and that's, that's really where the appearance panel is going to help us out, one of those things is actually adding a gradient. So if I want to add a gradient to this type, um, one would think that I could just use it for the fill. So I have a, a, a swatch in here, my swatches panel, that is a gradient. It's just white to black. If I choose that, you notice it shows on, on the left-hand side here that it's supposed to have that gradient as my fill, but of course my fill looks black. It doesn't look like a gradient. So there's a problem there. Now, one way that we can remedy, remedy this is to, I'm just going to make a, holding down Option or Alt, I'm going to drag out a new copy of this thing. And I'm actually going to convert it to outline. 